Fancy Mandy here again with another Shein haul. Um, <laughs> this time I went ahead and got some summer clothes because I, um, I don't have very many summer clothes here in Korea because I was not able to pack very many clothes when I came here. Um, so <laughs> I'm not a shopaholic I'm not addicted to shopping but I do have to have some clothes so um, I figured I would go ahead and do another haul for you like uh, this is for um, summer clothes <sighs> sorry my air conditioner makes these weird crazy noises that my boyfriend tells me is not normal so <laughs> well maybe not not normal but his doesn't do it so Meh. so without further ado let's go ahead and get into the haul um, I'm going to just be trying them on and then coming back I'm not gonna hold them up because that seems to make the video a lot longer so um, I want to make this as painless for you all as possible and I hope you enjoy here is the first item that I picked. It was a uh, set and I like a, like usual I will link everything in the um, description box. So it is a crop top uh, halter and it actually uh, is in a size 3x so the bottoms are a bit big and loose for me but the top fits perfectly like a crop top is supposed to fit. It is really nice material. It's like um, kind of like a t-shirt uh, and they're very comfortable. The waistband is well done so like the elastic inside isn't going to like flip around or anything. Like I said, I'm addicted to tie-dye so... And this is what the back looks like. Excuse my uh, fat rolls. Uh, but this is what the back looks like. It's pretty comfortable. I bought it for pajamas. This is not something I would wear ever in public, um, but that's just for my own comfort. But I, I did buy these for pajamas. Okay, so here's um, an outfit that I'm a little disappointed in. Uh, these shorts are, are okay. They like grew around my belly a little, but it's not too big of a deal for me. Um, I could have probably gone smaller. Um, I got the 4X because um, they have no stretch, it's no elastic, and it was buttons. So I could have gone with a 3X and probably been fine, and it would probably have looked better. But um, you know, I get this weird mom butt going. <laughs> um, the top, however, is in a 3X, so shorts are 4X. The top is a 3x and it is cut so weird it's too big in the actual boob part however this part of the shirt here is too small um, I'm not quite sure how it's supposed to fit it came with these which come not attached and they they don't do much to help so the shirt, I would probably skip on the shirt unless you are very small here and a little bit bigger up here instead of here because my boobs are bigger here. <laughs> so I don't, I'm not sure how this, this top works, but it just like hangs open and, um, it's just not finished well. Um, what if, it just it just doesn't work. Um, it's very see-through as well. So this is, I would say, probably pass on it unless you are a smaller woman. Okay. So outfit number two is this really cute like T-shirt that has a yellow ribbon like stripe around it goodbye and then here banana 
for like banana milk and then pink around here and blue around here. And it's just a standard t-shirt. Let's see. Um, I bought this in a 3X as well. Yes, a 3X. Um, the shorts are a 2X and they fit really well. They're not too short, so I could wear these in public. They are like crushed velvet, so soft. Um, a really pretty smoky mauvey pink color. They're a little thin. You can see my my underwear line, um, but you can't see quite through them. And of course, with everything I wear, you're gonna see my belly line. I have a belly. I don't mind it. It doesn't bother me um, for it to be seen a little bit. Um, but yeah, this one is really cute. So shorts are two X, and they're not too. They're, they're short, but they're not terribly short. Um, and the top is a 3X, and it fits really, really well. Okay, I am aware that I am weird shaped, just so you know. Um, so I got, I decided to pick out a bodysuit, which I've, I've never um, worn in my life. Well, in kindergarten, I wore one, but not since and this one it clips in the crotch area i bought a size 3x because i wanted to make sure it would be long enough to accommodate my belly and um clip i could have gone with the 2x lengthwise um but i needed the 3x around the waist so um and these shorts are very very cute but very 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 see-through um i don't i don't know if you can tell here but they're very see-through this is the line of the the um thing so if you have more hips this is this this top will definitely fit you um i think and whoa so the top is in a 3x the these bottoms are a two 2x so it's a like a um, little band mm -hmm. yeah I don't know how I feel I don't I don't think I look that good maybe together as an outfit this isn't that great but um, I like the shorts they're cute probably with a shirt that isn't tucked in it would be better uh, and I don't know maybe maybe with a different outfit uh, definitely underneath a dress I would definitely wear this okay, so I'm wearing the same bodysuit um, these are the shorts um, they are oddly long um, or the kind of short that I think they're supposed to be. This is ungodly long and it absolutely does nothing. It is held on by the tiniest piece of uh, red. So you can tie it, but it would still be ridiculously long. Like there's no reason for it to be that long. There's also no reason for your shorts to be this long and then your crotch comes down to here. So like you really would have to wear this with an, a shirt that's not tucked in so that it would look normal because they literally, if they're supposed to be where they're supposed to be and look normal, it would have to be like all the way up here. And remember guys, I'm 5'8", 172 centimeters, so, so like, I'm not short by any means, but it's, it's like half my body it feels like but they're cute shorts they're a little see-through I don't know they're still really high they're a little like thin material but very soft and very comfortable so I mean it's worth it's worth the the price I think if you can get past them being extremely long okay I'm aware that this shirt doesn't really match um these shorts I mean, it doesn't look too horrible with it. Uh, these shorts 
fit really, really well. Um, they are thin, they have no pockets. Uh, I would say the best thing about them is it comes with a belt, but unlike most of the Shein pants that come with like this belt, this has little hoops right here to keep it from sliding around and doing weird, crazy things. So the top is very cute. Like this, I was afraid would be itchy. It's very soft. Um, the top, I would say this is softer than this. This is not very soft. This is very like a little bit like a thicker Halloween costume material. So like an expensive Halloween costume. But this, this is really soft and this is really nice. Um, this could be irritating for somebody with very, very large arms, but it doesn't really bother me. It doesn't squeeze too bad. So, um, very cute top. I think this would look really good under some of my dresses because I wear a lot of dresses with shirts underneath them to keep it a little bit more modest. Um, these shorts are so comfortable. These shorts are in a one, one X and they're, they're see-through. Um, I don't know if you can, you probably can't because it's a dark color and my underwear are a dark color. <laughs> so, um, maybe it, but like if the sun goes, you can, you can definitely see, see through them. Um, but they're comfortable, definitely worth the probably $10, $10 I paid for them. Um, I like them. I would definitely buy another pair or two. And this feels a little bit like, like a linen type material. So it's very breezy and airy. Okay, so tie-dye item number two for this haul. Oh. <laughs> Is it really a haul if I don't buy tie-dye, you guys? Sorry, I just, I haven't felt like wearing makeup and my acne is starting to act up, act up a little bit in an odd place. Usually it's here, but today that's where it's gonna go. <laughs> okay, so this is a really cute like crop top. I normally wouldn't go for a crop top, but it was too cute. I couldn't pass it up and it actually doesn't hit in a spot that I would be too self-conscious to wear it in public. So I might actually wear this one in public. Um, the shoot. Okay, the, the top is in a 3X. The bottoms are a 1X. So here's the top. It actually, like, for me, like all my pants go up like above this level so like nothing would ever show so maybe like a little bit if I you know raise my arm and I don't mind that so much these are like black uh, with a little white line you can see my underwear line but you know it's kind of normal for cotton shorts and these do feel a little these feel like cotton to me um, like a little bit Maybe not cotton. Um, remember the pajamas you used to wear when you were a little kid, um, where they they had like a shorts and and a usually a short sleeve T-shirt, um, and they weren't the polyester kind. They were the other material, like the really thin cotton. That's what these remind me of. So I like them. Um, they fit really really well. So, like I said, 1x, 3x. 100% go by your measurements. Do not go by um, what size you want to wear um, because it might not fit. Like the one shirt I bought is a 3x. It should fit, but it's cut completely weird. Uh, the 4x pants or shorts, they fit. These are 1X, they fit. The other ones were 1X, they fit. 2X, they fit. So their sizes are all over the place. So look at the measurements and look at reviews, always. Okay, 
So I went ahead and decided to get a romper and try it out. Um, this actually fits fairly decent. It's a little short here. That's, um, I probably could have gone down to the 1X everywhere else except for the fact that the length. So like I said, always, always check your measurements because that's what's going to matter um, with these garments. Um, this is actually a pretty, a fairly thick material for Shein product. Um, it's not super thick, but it's thicker than normal. Um, it's, it's, it's cute. It's not terribly short, but it's not, it's not, it's definitely not long. Um, but I wanted this one um, because there was more room in the belly area and where I'm an apple shape. I wanted it to fit and to be flattering. So, I don't know. You guys, is it flattering? Is it cute? Oh, uh, the only downfall? No pockets. I mean, it's cute otherwise. Uh, I might, might actually wear this uh, out in public. Maybe. Definitely. Um, but I'd have to put something on, oh, under it or over it because I would get so many looks from mean little Hachimas. Um, I already get mean looks because I wear shorts. I wear big, full-length t-shirts that cover my arms down to here and that come down to here, but goodness lord, because I'm a fat girl wearing shorts, am I going to get looked at? Mm. Okay, so this is a little bit more wild. I probably also could have sized down in this dress. It's very, very, very long. It hits at my ankle or below my ankle. It is a very long maxi dress. It has a slit that is mid thigh. So, um, yeah, you have some, some, some legs showing. Um, it has a belt and it has the belt hoops as well. They're very thin though. Um, you can see very thin. It has spaghetti strapped and it is adjustable. Like the straps are adjustable a little bit, I, I'd say. Um, yeah, that fits a little bit better. It keeps the top up. There's definitely more uh, room in the, the boob area for um, more chesty <laughs> woman. This is in a three, three X and I have the belt tied around um, pretty tight. It's a very long belt and this would definitely fit some, some more people, <laughs> some more uh, bigger sized people as well, which is great. Um, because I think I was a work, I was worried that it would be too small, but it actually fits. Um, the material is, it's like a silkyish type, sorry, <laughs> silkyish type material. It's, it's fairly nice. It's, um, it's pretty cute. I would wear this. Okay, guys. So that is the, this is the end of the haul. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed it. I hope it wasn't too random or all over the place. My goal is always to try to be informative. I think it did pretty good. There's only one shirt that I absolutely hated. Um, one pair of shorts that I don't think flattered me the most, but I can still wear them uh, because I'm going to need shorts. Anyway, because it is so hot already here. I, I already got a little bit of sunburn. I don't know if you guys can tell. And that's just from standing at the bus stop. Um, my favorite, I would have to say my favorite are the shorts uh, from the uh, the two-piece set, uh, the crop top and short set, the tie-dye shorts. They're very comfortable. I totally recommend that set, you guys. Like, 100% recommend it. But I like this dress. It's a little wild print, but I think I could handle, I think I could handle this. Um, uh, 
let's see i know that i'm going to be um looking into purchasing some makeup soon so i will make a video on that uh on korean makeup and then i plan on doing some traveling so hopefully i can make some travel travel some travel uh footage with one home if there's any any uh Anything that you guys want me to try, let me know. Also, I plan on buying a f like maybe three or four bathing suits from Shein to see how they fit. If you are interested in that, um, give this video a like so that I can go ahead and purchase those. Um, I am a little self-conscious about my body, so bathing suit is, is definitely out of my comfort zone. But... If that's something that you guys would want to see, I would definitely bite the bullet and try on a, a few bathing suits for you guys. Um, other than that, uh, leave me a comment, like, subscribe, please. Um, have a beautiful day. Bye!